what's the, this projection called when I project another body in this waking state but I cannot touch objects. It can just pass through them. It can see any specific word. Activity is possible through this projection but consequences cannot be seen. Another body in the waking state. It is called bilocation. Go and search. I mean this is not our path. I don't know. You can call it bilocation, multilocation. It is possible because you are in the projected state right now. Project any number of bodies, if, you know, whatever you want to. But then if you are doing it, it will be a big achievement. The bilocation means you produce entire body in the waking state. Everybody can see it. There is no rule that you cannot make more than one copy, isn't it? It is memory only. You can make n copies. If you can achieve one copy, that will be a very big deal. That will be a very great achievement, in, especially in the physical. In the dream or in the projections, it will be easier, but still difficult, but, you know, comparatively easy. In the waking, the greatest of the tantrics cannot do it. There are reports. Actually, if you read the Tantra Bodhi section of our wiki, a technique is given to create a copy. If you don't have the natural talent to, you know, copy yourself, yourself means the body and mind, uh, in the waking state, in the waking world, then it can be done systematically, piece by piece, manufactured. And the technique is given in our wiki, in the occult section. Right? Many, if you can produce half of it, it will be good, no? Start by one. Yes, we can produce. Biolocation is very, very peculiar, specific. Because not only others, you can also see it. You can also see. You see, just like projection, when you, the etheric projection, come out of the body, it actually will look like that you are coming out of, out of the body and then you can see your phys physical body in the bed. Many reports are there. You can see the physical body. Sometimes the point of view will flicker from the physical to etheric to the etheric to physical. Same way, you will be able to see your bilocated body copy. And the bilocated you will be able to see the original. People won't be able to tell the difference. The differences are very minute. Only another tantric will be able to capture it. Because it will be an empty shell. Anyhow, if you can produce one copy, nothing can stop you from making another. And send them. Send them off in to do some work to meet people. <laughs> but you see, there are some limitations which I should not discuss right now. What you are describing is overlapping of waking and projecting. There, the memory bridge is so strong that your attention includes the waking. It is possible. So it is an, it is a projection only, but the waking has overpowered it. It is transition time from the waking to projection without entering the dream or sleep. So very good progress in this field, you can say, projecting. Continue experience, write down your experiences. There will be consequences. By projecting, we cannot bypass the karmic law. However, what will be the consequence in the waking state in this world, you know, physical world, the name of the waking state is physical world. What will be the consequence here? Hardly any. Unless you do something so strange that causes consequences in the physical world, there won't be much consequence. But yes, there will be consequences in your astral world or wherever you are, you see, who knows where you go. <laughs> the action is not possible in the physical world. If you can act in the physical world by being in etheric state, you know, it, it's possible in the etheric projection. Like the ghost phenomena, poltergeist phenomena is etheric projection. So they can cause a little bit of consequence here. But not much, you see. Nothing much to act. You need a physical body to actually produce a karmic consequence in the physical world. Uh, am I clear? Okay, okay. Let's go forward. Uh, Mary Singh, how is it possible to read the Akashic record? It's very easy, you know. Go to step number four first. There the technique is given. You need to make an intention in the um, emptiness state, in the, what do you call, zero point state. Can somebody tell me what is the, what, what is the name of that state where there is perfect silence? 
there you need to make a intention very strong intention that i want to re, uh, know this i want to read this in this kind of history a future and you will be taken there who knows what can happen after that's all illusion you see so everything is possible there and these videos they explain all kinds of experiments that you can do major experiments dozen of exper experiments one of them is reading of the past Okay, and he's saying, yes, I have found different terms being used, but have observed the nad stops and the experience can continue in the projected state. Yes, yes, probably you're talking about the change over from physical to the projected. The, yes, the, the, all this sounds and all that stops. Hopefully that's what you mean. It looks like we opened the Pandora's box now, <laughs> projected state. Vipin is saying, in the dreams, which is kind of projected state, it is seen that quality of experience influences body in waking, wo walking state, waking state, like general relaxation. Okay, waking. In case of pleasant dream and tiredness in case of unpleasant dream. As fruit of dream world are there in waking state. You are right. Yes, you are right. But how much? Five minutes. You see a kind of bad dream, hor horrifying dream. And then you wake up with that experience. The remains of horror, your fear and all. There will be physical effects, yes. You, your heart will be beating, you will be breathing. There will be sweating, trembling. Some people shout, jump in the bed. The, the, the dream is so horrifying. So these are the consequences. But they will go away in 5-10 minutes. If the consequences remain for many days, what has happened, happened here? Firstly, lack of intelligence. Secondly, no, no awareness that it was a dream. Taking the dream as true, some kind of childish thing, isn't it? There are some people, even the seekers who think the dreams are true, they have some meaning. They are garbage, no meaning. Sweet is saying that silence is so profound that no desires remain there. Okay, it's perfectly okay. If you want to enjoy the silence, which happens from disconnection from physical senses, now you are hanging there. In complete, we call it 3D blackness or the zone. There are many names actually. So I actually forgot what which one I <laughs> used. So those who know, they know. And it's your choice really. You can stay there. Come back after two hours, three hours. Very, very blissful. But those who have work to do, they cannot sit. And then they make the intention. And, you know, many projections, they fail because people are lost in the blissful states. So I say, okay, no problem. That's what you like, you do it. But if, if you get a desire, then you, you will be able to form an intention of it. Perfectly okay. Raja, I have started recording my dreams now. Dreams have been frequent recently in past few months. Earlier, there were hardly any dreams. Does this mean there is flickering of awareness? No, 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 no. On which step you are? I am asking Mr. Raja. Which step of the prog uh, program you are doing? Lesson 19. Focus on lesson 19. This is my suggestion. Why are you jumping on the step 4? Are you following my instructions or you have somebody else as your guru? Hidden guru, some secret guru who told you that to do the dream experiment? I know you are interested, but do you want to really follow the disciplined approach? Hmm, Pratip is saying many things happen. There is no interest really in projection. Somehow waking is preferred. Does a great master also lose his interest in projection? Yes. You see, when a newcomer joins this business of projections and altered states, there is interest. One or two experiences and then it becomes boring. So, we know we are in the projected state right now, isn't it? The waking is projected state. There is nothing but projection only. Even if you die, you will project in some world. So, <laughs> we stop paying attention. We stop doing it and naturally, and whatever is provided by Mother Nature is the best. Enjoy your stay here. You are a guest in this world for a little bit of time. Do that for which you are here, in projecting here. What are you doing here? Get hold of your pre location, get the knowledge, get the guru and you know, stop projecting again. What is the use of it? Just 
place. Okay, Rajay Singh, this was not experimented by me. It just happened, happening frequently. So, I am asking, you see, your, your question is, does that mean flickering of awareness? You see, don't worry about awareness. It will come. Finish your steps. Don't even think about it. Don't write it. Nothing. You will be told to do it. It's not that I am stopping you from... Uh, what I am asking is, go step by step. I know you are not attempting it, but go step by step. Pratip is saying, and I am assuming to do by location again, intention can work. Just pull all energy behind it. One part. See, it takes nothing to experiment. It takes a lot of interest only. So go ahead, experiment. But you see, <laughs> I don't guide on these things. I, I do not guide people. Nitin is asking, long back I had a dream thousand kilometers away about a real incident of accident of my father in which he died. The dream was almost similar to what actually happened. How can this be explained? This is called, called premonition and the explanation is very easy. The NP, NM, non-physical, non-mental memory is timeless. It's timeless. It already has all the impressions and we call it, it is pre-written. Predetermination. Sometimes you get a glimpse of it. Now you should not hang on to these words, you see. The words are simply explaining these experiences. Don't hang on to these things. They explain nothing actually. Give, give something to intellect to talk about. So is it possible? Yes. Thousands and millions of people get this. What happens is they do not discuss it with people. They, they tell their mother, father and partner and you know. But because of the fear of being called freak or some kind of crazy, they do not tell everybody. But there are major incidences where many people get the warning or what is called a pre-warn or they get the information like this. That be ready for this event. It is going to be a heavy event for you. And they get all this information, you see. So that is what is the Akashic record for you. It's already happened. Not only it has happened here now, the same thing has happened many times. That is mind-boggling. <laughs> repeat, repeat, repeat. This is the illusion. Cyclic. Existence is timeless. There are all possibilities. This is the ex explanation. You don't need to know more than this. Because the more you want, the more complicated it will become and then useless. Nitin is saying it happened on the same day of incident. Yes. Then it will be remote viewing. When the time is exact, it is happening and you are knowing. And this kind of premonition will be will have a different name now. That will be called remote viewing. It is also called clear vision. Clear vision in occult. Go and search. Many people have it. 